Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. We are officially in the top 60, and what a fucking feeling it is. Guys, there is one thing I know for sure, and that is that we are cracking on. We're making our way through the list. 40 videos. 40 videos, 40 of the best. And uh, look, all I can hope for is that you've enjoyed some of the content I've produced. Guys, this is Rugby Player Reacts to the NFL's Top 100 Players of 2021. It's a video series I'm extremely passionate about. It's a video series uh, I'm extremely proud of. And it's a video series you can expect to see on this channel each and every year into the future. So guys, first and foremost, thank you for clicking on this video. Thank you for supporting the channel. If you want to support it even further, hit the like button. And if you want to go above and beyond, you can always stay tuned as we hear from our exclusive video sponsor, The Ridge Wallet. Sup guys, first and foremost, thank you for clicking on this video. Secondly, this video is brought to you by none other than The Ridge, makers of the world famous and now YouTube famous, at least on my channel, Ridge Wallet. In less than two seconds, I'm going to show you exactly what the hype's all about. Nick Minute. That's what it's all about. This wallet holds just as much as this, yet this one is bulky, ugly, and outdated. Now this one, being that it is a Ridge wallet, holds 12 cards, it's sleek, it's stylish, it holds cash. There's over 30 different styles, including this one, which is matte black, and this one, currently unopened, which is 18 karat gold. Not only does the look and design speak for itself, but the packaging is next level also. And when it comes to giving a gift, when it comes to even gifting yourself, when you deserve it, of course, that's a win. The whole entire wallet is the exact size of a credit card, and the way that you access the cards is to push up from the bottom. Let's be honest, 40,000 five-star reviews, they don't lie. There is a lifetime warranty on each of these wallets. If, for whatever reason, you're not happy, you have a 45-day window to receive a full refund. I've got to be honest, at first I was skeptical. I have seen it advertised on other YouTube channels, YouTube channels I respect, actually, and enjoy watching. So it was only a matter of time until I tried it out for myself. It's not only wallets. The website does have an entire range of products designed to carry less and live more. And that is a quote that I've actually lived by for years. Head over to www.ridge.com slash Jacob. Use code Jacob for 10% off. And I guarantee you, this will be, whether it's in black or 18 karat gold, the last wallet you'll ever use. Guaranteed. Because there's no way in the world I'm going to be carrying something like this round anymore. Cheers, guys. And enjoy the video. Right, my friends. Here we are to check out number 60 on the list of the top 100 players in the NFL for the year of 2021. He's a center. He plays for the Chargers. His first name's Corey. There's a lot of C's going on here. Um, Corey, the center from the Chargers. In my opinion, that is C to the power of three, a.k.a. C cubed. But let's continue. When we do one-on-one -on -one reps uh, at practice, I had to go up against him sometimes. So uh, I think it was one rep when he was like, Z, you want to be the best? Well, you got to go against the best. So... <laughs> He's confident. Man, I remember when Corey was a little runt at uh, Ohio State. <laughs> a little runt? You're kidding me. Well, Cam, uh, normally I would take your word for it. But in this case, I'm going to do my own research. Let's have a look at Corey Lindsay's stats. Not to be confused with Lindsay Lohan. In fact, there's my mistake. I spelt the last name wrong. Corey Lindsay. What? Hang on. I'm going to say that Corey Lindsay might well be the first NFL player I've looked up without a Wikipedia. Just joking. Corey Linz Lee. Okay. My bad, guys. I'll take that one on the chin. Doesn't matter how many times I was going to look at that last name. I was never going to see that second L for some weird reason. Anyways, anyway, let's confirm. Some size, some stats, and whether he was actually a runt in college. Well, I'm not quite sure about his college stats just yet, but at the moment, he's listed at six foot three and 300 pounds. Got picked up with the 161st pick in the fifth round of the 2014 draft. He went to the Packers, and in the offseason, he's been traded to the Chargers. So that's most probably why we're hearing from Zadarius Smith, who's a fellow Packer, last year. That makes sense. So he attended an Ohio State Pro Day, and, uh, well, did rather well for a center. 5.03 for the 40-yard dash, 4.53 for the 20-yard shuttle, 7.46 for the three-cone drill, 27 inches for the vertical, 8 foot 11 on the broad jump. Look, he's 6 foot 3, but he ain't going to be doing any 360 dunks anytime soon. 36 reps on the bench, which is well up there, and uh, 
33 on the Wonderlic, which is also well up there. And here we have it, the final sentence of his Wikipedia page, and the sentence that basically sums up the reason why he's on this list. On March 17th, 2021, Lindsay signed, or Linz Lee, sorry, signed a five-year, $62.5 million contract, making him the highest paid centre in the league. And before we continue, I must show you one thing, and that is this. Chargers, baby. Right, here we go. C cubed, Corey Lindsay, a centre, playing for the Chargers, although his career up to this point has been spent with the Packers. Uh, things have changed. Find it. Set it. Just like here. Oh yeah, I didn't I didn't actually read about his college. And look, your your guess is as good as mine as far as whether Cameron Haywood is actually telling the truth. Um but he's a big boy now. Find it. Set it. Finding a center is easier said than done. Especially one as good as Corey Lindsley. Corey a baller. Gotta give much respect to him, man. He he does his thing, man. Able to get down the trenches strong, squatty guy, move people out the pile, get them out of the way. is your last because it's the playoff every play is your last don't take a breath don't take a break let's go in the divisional playoffs when brandon staley's number one rams d squared off with Corey lindsley's number one packers o lindsley's o went for 484 yards 32 points and ended the ram season Look at that. That is using every ounce of his size, strength, and power to protect that quarterback. The Packers had more passing yards and more rushing yards than the Rams had allowed all season. Hand off to Jones up the middle, has a hole. Breaks through yeah. to the five. Cutting left, 45, 50, 40. You like to see that. You love to see a running back see some daylight get there by way of the center. Look at that, right behind, right behind the center. Hey, Austin, hey, I got to the third level on touch. Going against the best brought out the best in Lindsley and his offensive line. Enzo, touchdown! Looked like he favored the block. We're talking third level, as in past the linemen, past the linebackers, into the backfield, by way of C cubed. Like Corey Lindsley inside. Corey Lindsley! Hell of a job! So when Staley was named head coach of the Chargers, he wasted no time finding his center. Yeah, I'd be happy too. Oh, State. Secured Reverend. your bag, mate. Very deserving of the contract you got. I'm just excited for him. I uh, hate that we lost him, man. But, you know, all blessings to him. Indeed. All blessings to him. And with that being said, that brings us to the end of another video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the support. If you have enjoyed it, hit the like button. Remember to head down into the description box below and check out our exclusive video sponsor for today. And I'll see you back here shortly for the next video. Number 59, Jason Pierre-Paul. Defensive end for the Buccaneers. Super Bowl winner. Peace out.